Yo, what is up guys? This is Tito back with another video and today in this video I'm gonna show you how to go back to MIUI when you are on Android VGSI build. Well even I don't know yet how to go back to MIUI from this GSI because I never tried it myself. Like I never went back to MIUI from a treble GSI and let me show you the about section here quickly. As you can see the Android version is 9 here and if I tap on it well as you can see there is a hallucinating easter egg of android p so i'll just try to flash the miui 875 build which i have in my storage right now which is the miui 10 global beta build and that is the anti 3 version so yeah i'm gonna flash it with lazy flasher zip and see what happens and frankly i do not have any idea what's gonna happen so let me just power off the device now as it might even break my redmi note 5 pro and I backed up everything from my device as you know it can get encrypted and stuff like that so I just backed up everything on my PC so I'll just show you guys what happens so yeah let's just do this so now press the volume up and the power button together to boot into TWR recovery so as you can see we are booted up into TWR recovery but the brightness is too high so let me just decrease the brightness for you so that you guys can see it better i think it's all right now so first go to wipe then advanced now i am selecting dalvik cache data system and vendor as well so now swipe to wipe so as it's done go back go to install and now let's select the miui875 build which is anti 3 not anti 4 and now let's add the lazy flasher zip file and let's flash it and boom swipe to confirm flash and see what happens and as you can see it says the flashing procedure is completed so we have some hope here so let's just tap reboot system now and you're gonna see this no is installed warning too do not worry just swipe to reboot and i just waited for 10 to 20 minutes for the device to boot up and as you can see it actually booted up into miui 10 but it says the device is locked because i had the find device on when i was on miui last time so now I have to connect to my Wi-Fi and put my MI ID here and set it up. So I'll just do that and come back. So as you can see, I'm back again on MIUI and let me show you the about section here quickly. And here it says the 875 MIUI 10 build of course. Now I'll just check if I still have the TWR recovery or if it shows the storage as encrypted. So let me just reboot the recovery and show you guys. And as you can see, we are booted into TWR be fine without any issues and if I tap over here as you can see it says data successfully decrypted and if I go to install yes it does show me the internal storage files here and the internal storage space shows fine here too so it's definitely fine and the storage did not get encrypted so let me just reboot through system again and show you if things like camera volte are working And as you can see the camera is working fine even portrait mode is there and working fine so everything is back again at normal stage and even Valti calls from Geo again is working fine so yeah everything is working super fine so there you have it conclusion yes you can go back to MIUI ROM from Android PGSI anytime so that's really a good thing so you don't have to worry about it like if you can go back later or not after flashing Android P there you have it that's pretty much it for this video guys thank you so much for watching hit the big thumbs up button if you liked it and subscribe to the channel if you have not yet this is tito from kdn tech signing off for today and i'll catch you guys in the next one